Hey there friends, it's Vanessa. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am here at Disney Springs. I thought I'd start a new series, I guess, or start a bunch of videos where I take you along my different Disney adventures, basically vlogs for lack of better words. And I thought today I'd start by going down to Disney Springs, showing you guys around. For those of you who don't know what Disney Springs is and what's all available, and I'll get to see what's new. So let's jaunt over there together. We all need to remember that I'm parking in the orange parking lot. Let's all remember that. That I parked in the orange lot on the roof because I'm that extra. Well, really, I just like to park away from people. And the orange lot is my favorite lot because it's the easiest to get into out of all of them. But here's kind of our view from the top because it's the best. I know you really can't see it through the grate, but look at that. Look at that. I know it's beautiful. Wow, I'm out of focus. So now let's head down an elevator or should we take the stairs? Mm, it feels like stairs kind of day. First things first, on our little adventure, I need to get a snack, so that's all it is. But there are a lot of different sections of Disney Springs, so there are sections that have like a lot of restaurants, more of the Disney shops, and then more of like live entertainment. So let's take a tour over this way. Down here is more of the entertainment district, so back there is Cirque du Soleil, the uh, NBA experience, as well as the House of Blues, and up here is Jose, but there's Splitsville, as well as the movie theater, and some other shops up here, along with um, Starbucks, which you saw, and a couple of food trucks, which I'll show, but this is kind of the entertainment area, and then we get into more of the live music, and some other shops, but mostly restaurants, and then into the Disney stores. So let's head on over there. Now we're gonna head into one of my favorite stores here, which is Disney style. And I jokingly say that it's the almost Forever 21 of Disney stores just because of the different style of merchandise they carry. Not to say that none of Disney merchandise is trendy. They're definitely on par, especially right now with everything that they're doing. But this one is particularly different and you'll see why.
llama socks? An absolute yes. Okay, I feel like this I need to get, like right now. Also this one, I just need it all. One thing I've always wanted is one of these little groups because they sit on your shoulder. There's a little magnet and you put that under your clothes and he sits on your shoulder. Comment down below if I should grab him or not. Probably be too late, but I've always wanted one. He's so cute. How big is too big for a Baymax? I don't think this is too big. So cute. Let me know down below which one, which princess is your favorite princess. Let me see if I can find mine. She's usually hidden, which is unfortunate. Is she still hidden in this store? Probably. Frozen in here. That 
that's for sure. So much frozen. Sadly, we did not find a duffy, as I kind of figured that would happen, but we're going to end 
end our night here and I hope you guys enjoyed this little adventure down into Disney Springs and stay tuned for more adventures through Disney. If you want to follow along on my day-to-day -day adventures, make sure you go to Instagram, type in Vanessa Jordan Photo, and that's where you can follow me on that. And I'll leave all the links in the description on places that we visited, things I mentioned, all stuff like that. And make sure you give this video a like if you liked it, and subscribe if you want to see more like this. So until next time, 